more local leaders speaking out about the increase in the number of asylum seekers headed to New York State as more migrants continue to cross the southern border with the ending of Title 42, the pandemic era border restrictions that have now expired. The migrants have been making their way to New York City via buses. However, leaders in the city say their shelters are at full capacity. That's the reason they're coming up this way to many other places. Next step, those leaders say, is to bus the migrants to other parts of the state. So as one of the first counties to declare an emergency, Rensselaer County leaders say the city has recently recovered from financial hardship and they're not prepared to handle the influx of migrants. This is not, you know, a Democrat, Republican issue. I know a lot of folks out there try to make it a political issue. This is not. This is about the people of Troy. This is about our residents. It's about the people of the county and ensuring their safety and at the same time that they're getting the services that they pay for. Saratoga, Schoharie, Fulton and Greene counties have also declared states of emergency. This way they can access federal funds. News 10 has much more on this story for you on air and online.